from the woods and waters, lakes and streams. The outdoors calls us to chase our northern Michigan dreams. We are family, we are friends. Our adventure starts where the black top ends. Come along and join in the fun. We here at D&D Wild Outdoors hold our passion for the wild second to none. Hey guys, Derek with D&D Wild Outdoors. We, uh, this is kind of the second stop for us today. We started our morning out on Fife Lake. Um, we've been having some super gnarly weather. Um, just giving us really rough ice conditions. Uh, right now we've got, um, you can see my footprints here sinking into the snow. We've got water and slush and slop. We got a good amount of ice under it. We just, uh, we got some hard travel and, and Fife Lake was super, super hard to travel on this morning. I actually wanted to uh, um, fish out there uh, for a tournament that's coming up this weekend, but with all the travel, I watched quads get stuck and uh, snowmobiles get stuck this morning. And uh, I worked my butt off getting around out there and I only caught one little pike. So uh, I just kind of opted to bail out of that and uh, maybe go back later February. But um, we're out here on our walleye lake. We just picked up a nice perch. We'll show you that. And we have a flag just popped. Last week we were out here and had zero success one evening. Uh, didn't even mark anything in uh, one of our go-to walleye spots so we're getting kind of stressed out you know not seeing what we thought we would so um, we're gonna hit this tip up and we're gonna start jigging and hopefully this evening the barometer is uh, in the dropping point right now that's kind of exciting so maybe the change will get things fired up for the evening so let's knock this tip up out and uh, hopefully we can get some more footage and get some more fish on the ice tonight let's do this all right guys here's that uh perch we just picked up pretty nice probably 11 11 inch perch on a jigging rack when we first walked up to this tip up it was spooling pretty good so hoping that this is the first walleye of the night oh, i hope man it's been uh it's been a heck of a week at work and a heck of a week of uh not getting any fish here so Hopefully we can cure that. Um, fish on feels pretty small. Yeah. Oh, yeah, little head shakes. Wow. Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? Look at this thing. Huh. Well, like I said, it Hoping for the first walleye of the night. Nice perch, guys. Oh, yeah. Look at that one. Look at that. Oh, look at that jigging wrap slammed in there. Oh, that's a good perch, you guys. Wow. Look at that. <laughs> Nothing better than getting them on the jig right now. Hooked up, guys. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys. Whoa. Giant perch. Oh my gosh. Okay. That's a huge tank. Holy cow, he's just fat. Whoa, on that jigging wrap, you guys. All white jigging wrap. Woo! Just hooked up again, you guys. There's more down there. Oh my gosh. Yes. Yes, jumbos. Oh my gosh. We gotta get back down there, guys. Look at this. Ouch. I got another rod right here with uh, wigglers on it. I thought maybe, cause he just, he just puked up a bunch of wigglers. Holy cow, they're down there. Oh, I 
missed him. I missed him. He, he slammed the, the wiggler. There's two of them down there. We got to get back down there. Wow. Ouch. Wow. Freaking mega tanks. You, my gosh. Holy. There we go. Got one on the minnow, guys. Nice. Oh my god, I lost him right at the hole, you guys. It was a tank. Oh. Oh, big one. Big in. Chicken wrap again. Oh, get off of that. Nice one. We gotta get back down there. Man, they came in heavy. There was probably four and they just rocketed up. Whew. You know what's so weird is I've got live bait down there wigglers and minnows on another rod and they won't hit it they want the artificials look he's coming up they're coming up at it right now oh my gosh i got him oh tank oh my gosh Oh my gosh, not letting off of them. Oh my goodness. Tankzilla. Stay on there. Stay pinned. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Guys, look at this thing. Oh my gosh. Oh, almost dropping down the hole. Look at that, you guys. We gotta get back down there. Oh. As I was dropping, they came flying up at it. Hooked up, guys. I'm not sure. This must be a walleye. them you guys they're biting my other rod guys oh my goodness oh my gosh oh my goodness this might be more than this little guy can handle what what is this I don't know what it is, but it's big. Whoa. All I have is just a little, little single hook on here. No. Freak. 
freaking way. No way. Oh my god, you guys. Holy crap. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. Holy smokes. I gotta send that right back down there. Guys, this is sick. That's a, that's a 16, 17 inch perch. I got another one right here on the jig and wrap and hailed it. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my God, there's another one down there. I gotta go down. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, dude. Pigs, you guys. Insane. Never caught perch that big. That might have to go on the wall, guys. That's, these are stupid huge. Like, I've never even, holy cow. Oh my God. It is coming up. It's coming up. I cannot tell you, you guys. That's incredible. Here he comes. Oh, he smashed it and I missed him. He's heading back down. Oh my goodness. Guys, I mean, these are I don't I can't even tell you. Huge giants. Oh my gosh. Hooked up, guys. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Look at this. Freaking giant jumbo perch on a big wrap. Man, I thought for sure that was. <sighs> you have got to be kidding me. That is crazy. On oh, my big wrap, I thought it was a walleye. Morning guys, Derek with D&D. We are back out here on the perch grounds where we uh, where we got into them last evening. I um, think we're going to make a compilation vid of last evening's perch fishing and then uh, whatever we get into this morning, which is hopefully some more perch. Um, I have found in the past that if if they were here the night before then they're here the next morning now granted um things change i will say that it's snowing it's kind of pretty out here right now it's quiet no wind um the barometer has dropped so conditions at least on in the human eye look better but we'll just have to wait and see as far as uh what really goes down but um have not marked anything yet so still hopeful um we took some tip-ups and uh, went very, very light line, two-pound test, and uh, some perch minnows on it. So we're hoping that maybe uh, maybe running some lighter line and some perch minnows will get the, get the fish active on those and uh, just give us more opportunity to it. So we've kind of veered our, our direction from walleye to perch mainly. So we'll see what the day brings, guys. Uh, thanks for being with us. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. This will be like a, a secondary um, intro to like halfway vid. So thanks. Let's uh, let's see what we can get in. Hooked up, guys, just like that. Not sure what it is. Feels like uh, maybe a small perch. Yup, yup. The perch are here this morning, guys. Yes. Not a giant by any means. Oh, there's more down there. I gotta get down. Come on. Ouch, ow, in the finger. Hooked up, guys. This is not feeling like a perch. Oh, it is, though. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. On that jig and wrap, guys. Holy smokes. This is my new go-to. It's practically all I use anymore. <laughs> oh, my gosh. See what's on it. We left it up for a little while, so Oh yeah, we got a fish on there. 
It's got a little weight to it, nothing crazy. Ooh. Stay on there. Definitely not real big. Oh, there we are to the line. Hey, so look at this tiny little walleye. Good grief, just a pencil. The perch we're catching are bigger than that. Are you kidding me? Well guys, that's going to wrap it up for uh, this video. Um, this morning's bite was a very short window of opportunity. We had uh, that little storm front that was here this morning had the barometer uh, on the drop and then as soon as it moved out, the fish moved out with it and it just shut right down. Um, we did get on one nice perch and uh, we got three perch all together. I mean, these are still nice, you know, the eight, nine, or eight, nine inch range. Obviously, these 12s are awesome. But uh, we ended up keeping that 15 inch walleye. Um, one thing we've kind of noticed in this lake is that there is such an abundance of walleye in here and predator fish that um, it's kind of stunning the growth of the walleye. So taking out a few walleye even at that 15 inch range those are perfect eaters um i think that's i think that's good for the environment honestly so needless to say we are gonna go have a mega fish fry tonight off the perch that we got earlier in the video and these ones and uh you know basically basking uh basking what we do you know eating these fish is a uh, part of all the hard work that we do so Sure appreciate you guys being out here with us. Uh, sorry that the video is kind of lapsed in multiple stages. Uh, it's hard to get one trip uh, worth of constant footage. Um, but, uh, you know, there again, just thanks for being out here with us. And uh, we'll see you out here on the hard water soon. We're going to stay at it. Um, we're finally getting some uh, colds and some better ice. So hopefully we can uh, continue to bring you guys some action. Thanks for being with us. We'll see you out here on the hard water or in the woods soon. D&D &D out.